My master. <laughs> Safe. The scriptures. Sound. All I ever wanted was a life in my mountain. Free from you and your so-called merits. Those high above don't trust me. I understand that. And they send you and those knuckleheads to threaten me. To obey and serve once more. <laughs> I understand that too. But what I don't understand is... You bastard killing my kind! Not just any monkey. He's a monkey of merit. A monkey was made Buddha once. None other than me can challenge him to a duel. Look, monkey. I don't make a habit of fighting someone I've bested before. Here's my offer. If you lose, I'll take you to the Celestial Court. They will stay and level your mountain. But if I lose, I shall certainly take revenge, and they will level your mountain nonetheless. Hmm. How tragic would that be, huh? You are one of the court. We don't need to resort to violence. How about you bend the knees, admit the wrongs, and we can put this behind us? <laughs> All these years, except for that pig, you're the one who talks the tallest tales. Good, I am entertained. Speaking of entertainment, wouldn't it be fun if I pluck your extra eye out for my snack and allow you to keep the other two? Because I'd hate to let you miss how I'll slaughter each mongrel of the court. Those below, those above, and that black mutt of yours. Come at me, all of you. Glorious fighting Buddha. Have you any idea how many would give their everything for immortality? Immortality? <laughs> for that word, all realms and beings have ruined themselves. <laughs> the Celestial Court welcomed you, foul monkey, yet you remain untamed. None shall save you now. <laughs> Dear brother, your edge needs homing. Good. I was in need of a back scratcher. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Kiss my axe! You call that a duel? The glare up here is dazzling. Fight me in the woods if you have the guts. And so ends the last tale of Sun Wukong. A hero who treasured his freedom above all else. Buddhahood he attained, yes, but cumbersome he found the celestial rules, for he yearned to come back and to revel in the simple joys with us. Little did he know, his choice to forgo the life above only fueled their mistrust. <sighs> this stone has stood for countless days on the mountain. Since my youth, they said that his remains lie within it. <clears throat> Unbegotten, undying, such is the nature of a stone monkey. Though his body was broken, his spirit endures. Into six relics he turned, and separately they escaped, choosing to stay hidden. Those are the six senses of the great sage. Yet no one has ever seen them, not in centuries. I'm old now. Venture through all the lands, I cannot. Yet among you, there might be one who is destined. One that shall recover all his scattered relics. And upon the return of the relics to Mount Tuaguo, he may yet rise again. On the gold bend the toll life of human or for gold. Nowhere better than a home. We cheat death and ever grow. Huh? Here 
You see, what bliss my fate well, shows. Well, <laughs> luck's around the corner. Seems like you just fell from a fruit Ooh, yes. tree here. Perfect timing. This peach knew I needed a snack. <laughs> What you waiting for? Pluck your hair and make an offer. Hey, hey, wait! Hi. The Keeper of Black Wind Mountain have long been waiting for your arrival. Oh, his spitting image, I'd say. Up ahead is Guan Yin Temple. Once it was bustling with worshippers, before it was ruined by that fire. Ah. Then... The temple was rebuilt. Oh, what good is it to rebuild a temple if the goodwill of men has been burnt to ashes? Oh. You've forgotten this place, but they haven't forgotten you. Oh. That's a tough one. Good luck to you! You can just parade in, do you? It's not that simple. Let me transform you into a golden cicada so you may follow the fires ahead and scout this mountain unnoticed. Fly! <laughs> uh, it might be humble. But my shrine is very versatile. You'll get it soon. Shh, keep quiet. You don't want to set off that beast. In the backyard is Black Wing Gwai's ally, calls itself Ling Shutsa. Considering your strength, I suggest you oh, no. get away while you can, little monkey. Hmm. 
Have you seen those nameless souls adrift on your path? Their wills float aloft, never to fade. Shame, your god serves little purpose, and mine answers solely to me. Hmm. I know a way to guide the souls, mend their paths, and set them free. It will aid you. Now, this is better. This gourd, though humble, may save the lost, banish their obsessions, and guide them. <laughs> These snake guys are nothing to fear. Snake gall steeped in drink, though, makes a fine tonic to flush malady. Here, here, young friend. Be my guest inside. Hailed bird, hailed bird, what dimmed your shine? Past's grip beyond our grasp. The future we may still clasp. Late is the hour, young one, in which you choose to stain my tranquil abode. Pray tell, to what end do you seek? You have forced my hand. Now you shall face what I truly am. <laughs> Halt! No ill will, I bear. I'm merely my brother's eyes and ears. I feign my loyalty to guard this path on the bear's order. Your destiny's bleak and stark. In its grip, we share the mark. The Guanyin Temple now lies in cinders, yet the Elder Soul endures. The root of greed and fosters the stem of suffering. <sighs> Better to forget the thing you truly seek. <laughs> oh, thank me to Oh, finally then, the three bells sang. Disciples come, I hear travelers approaching my temple, carrying new treasures. <laughs> I cannot see you, but I recognize your odor. Kasaya! Now give it back! <laughs> Two hundred and seventy years spent. <laughs> Kasaya's collected by the hundreds. <sighs> Still one chalk without his. Stop, stop, stop! The coercion, Bobo! Leave it! Just leave it! Stop the fire!
Five. You have some cheap tricks! Meet me at the summit if you dare! <laughs> the spell he just cast may appear intricate, but it's not hard to learn. That Black Bear's expertise is lacking. Serving Guan Yin didn't help him much. But what he left here could surely help us. Consider today your lucky day. <laughs> He once told me, out of sight, out of mind is a fool's task. Seeing but seeing through is what wise men do. But didn't he turn mad by what he saw too? <laughs> of the Celestial Palace! His words ring true. No matter how daring he was, he had not the nerve to harm the Great Sage. There must be someone else pulling all the strings. Exactly! And this thing is eerie! I have no idea how to make use of its power! Except to enshrine it up there! Tricking lesser Yaoguais into offerings. If you pardon me, I'll go back to Guan Yin to atone for my actions and be put back on the engaging band. You will never see me out there anymore. I oh, ignore his nonsense. Go now, little monkey. Go and retrieve the great sage's relic.卷青，千万缘，色与空
弹指间，轮回路有万次千，求不得。闭上眼，一生功名。沉落花冠不倦，涅盘究竟寻常事，有情出不愿。Puzzles me. A monk's lust for gold should be quelled. Why does Elder Jinche still cling to that one Kasaya? Hmm. Bereft of that Kasaya, how shall they show the world their ties are cut and their lust is quelled? Across streams, over hills, and through the black wind, your blood has spilled. Wolves howl, snakes wind, flames lick, and the smoke blinds. Stumble on the lesser, lame, crash before their betters, shame. With such clumsiness, what destiny do you claim? As the small fish catches its prey, the bigger lurks behind. Who is the bigger fish? I can't see it. As for the prey and the small fish, <laughs> they are swimming everywhere. <laughs> 